Take a good look. The security cameras give us a great view of the thieves using stolen credit cards to make purchases at a local Wawa. Cherry Hill police say the cards came from pocketbooks swiped out of parked cars at Future Fitness. The crooks see valuables left behind, bust out a window, voila, grab and go. Are the two women working together? It would appear so, yeah, because of one uh, surveillance tape of a, a Wawa, the two came in together. The pair hit this parking lot three times Monday and twice more Tuesday morning. Gym members we talked to hadn't yet heard about the thefts, but the general subject, leaving valuables visible in your car. I don't think people, you know, take a, as good a care as they should, thinking everybody, it's an honest world and it's not. Well, actually, I'm a little too lax with it, so I guess I'll be more careful now. You, you tend to leave some stuff Yeah, I do, I do. But not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> now I won't. Usually I lock my stuff in the glove compartment. Um, and usually I don't leave anything visible. So pretty much I like to keep it away or don't bring it at all. Managers at Future Fitness would not talk to me on camera, but say they are reaching out to members via Facebook to notify them of the thefts. And we'll soon begin installing security cameras in the parking lot. Until then, say police. Everyone, anywhere, you have to secure your valuables. You're, you're just inviting these problems when you leave, uh, when you leave valuables inside an automobile. Cherry Hill police tell me they've elevated this case to so-called mission status. That means they'll devote specific resources to keeping an eye on that health club parking lot. In the meantime, when you're out and about, hide your valuables, make it tough on the crooks. Let them hit the next car down the line. In the newsroom, I'm Bruce Gordon, Fox 29 News.